What is going on guys and welcome back to another video here on the Loud and Proud YouTube channel. Before we get into this, keep in mind right now 20 times bonus entries are live towards winning this beautiful 99,000 mile 5 speed manual 12 valve Cummins that comes with $5,000 in cash. So if you want to get entered to win this thing, lmpgear.com and we're also running a huge bonus if you've seen on our Instagram or Facebook or emails that we send huge bonus for people who download and use the app and place an order on it right now use that ends Wednesday night at 11 59 p.m for the app bonus but 20x bonus entries week does end on Sunday night take advantage of it while you can we just got back from a two week long trip and I get back and this truck is just totally dead. And there was something turned on, some switch lower down. I don't know what it was, but for some reason the truck is totally dead. And I tried to jump it yesterday for just a couple of minutes. And even with jumpers hooked on, I couldn't get a single light on the dash to show. However, first time I did put the key in, there was like just a, just hard, just hardly a glow of something on the dash. And then after that though, it just, there was just nothing at all. Even once I hooked it up to jumpers with another truck running, just nothing on the dash at all. So I'm going to be pulling the batteries out of this truck, putting them on some uh, trickle charging units and letting them sit overnight. I'm not really sure what happened. All I know is that whenever the kid is out here with me, he likes to get into the trucks and he likes to flip switches, turn stuff on, and usually never turn stuff off. He just likes to turn stuff on, which, sometimes just ends up killing all the vehicles around here. So, you know, I'm gonna see on a trickle charger and then clean up the batteries and try to see if the dates on them are showing that they're old. If they are, I'll just probably end up buying new ones anyway. That's a great way to start out the day. On another note, I'm gonna be running into town here with Rosine, which by the way, we should have a winner for this truck any day now. Yes, of course, seven to 14 days. Generally, we do have a winner. Every once in a while, it goes over kind of like with the first gen winner, but it should be any day now. We should have a winner for this truck. And if you want to stay up to date with the most recent information with what's going on with trucks and winners and stuff like that, follow us on Instagram. Links are always in the description below or on Facebook. And usually we have winner announcements and stuff on our stories and posts there before anywhere else, just because it's the quickest form of communication to hop on real quick. Send it out, you know, send out a post or something, and then you guys can be notified immediately. Versus on YouTube, I kind of have to like plan out some content, make stuff, film, edit, all that stuff. So it just takes more time before you get the information. Uh, that being said, we're gonna start this thing up for the first time in almost three weeks, and then get her on down the road. First start in almost three weeks. We are back with Rosine. Just got her parked in the shop. I do have the batteries for the dually sitting on a trickle charger up in the garage here. But I do want to kind of lead some hints to something that I've been hiding from you guys now for just a handful of days. And I'm going to continue to hide it for almost two weeks. But I did make a purchase of a truck that is going to be pretty cool it's gonna be pretty cool i'm kind of keeping it a secret because i want the reveal of this thing to not take place until it's done timing i've learned in the past you know several months year now timing is big okay and so when it comes to reveals and stuff like that I've kind of taken a new position on how and when i do those and this is no exception to that rule this thing is getting a complete transformation before you guys see it. And before it's revealed on the channel, it's gonna go from what it is now to something absolutely insanely awesome. And I will give you one hint as to what it is, what truck it might be. And this is not gonna narrow it down very much because, well, I've owned a lot of trucks. It was a personal truck on our channel. I will say that, that is it. That's the only thing I'm gonna give you. Now, again, we've had quite a few personal trucks. I'm not gonna give you the year of it, the motor that's in it, anything like that. But it was a personal truck for a little while and it's pretty cool. So that's it, that's all I'm gonna leave it at. Take your guesses down in the comment section below. If I were to have bought back a personal truck at one point, 
which truck do you think it would be? So take your guesses in the comment section below what truck you think it is. I'm not gonna tell you if you're right or not, but if we can get some conversation going, get some guesses going. I'm interested in seeing which one you guys think I would have bought back. After all the years we've been on YouTube, all the trucks we've had come through our hands, which one of the trucks do you think, of all the trucks, which one would he have bought back? Comment down below. And on that note, I know the Dually does not currently have batteries in it. They're on a trickle charger. The kid killed the batteries, turned something on. I don't even know what he turned on. There's some switch on the lower part of the dash. He flipped it on. And I remember testing it one time and I'm like, I don't even know what this turns on. And then he got back in the truck and he must have flipped it again because when I got in and checked, it was flipped on again, which I didn't flip it on. And for some reason, whatever it is, totally drained the batteries when we were gone for two weeks and the batteries are sitting on a charger now. But you can enter to win this truck plus $5,000 cash and get 20 times bonus entries right now. And in terms of the Rosine 24V here, we should have a winner any day now. I know sometimes we get winners that are just seven days after the giveaway ends. Sometimes it's right on that 14 day mark. Sometimes it can go over just a few days. So do not panic, stick in there, hold the faith. There has not been a winner drawn yet. But again, keep in touch with our social media because when we do have a winner, that's usually the first place that it gets posted because it's the fastest way to communicate. So stay tuned and best of luck. If you're wondering who I'm referring to for killing the dually, <laughs> yeah, you did it. Did you kill daddy's truck truck? Did you push the buttons in the dually? Yeah. You did? <laughs> yeah. You did, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, well, that's why it's dead. Um, but all that being said, uh, I, I do hopefully have a, a, another business venture potentially coming up that involves these creatures back here. So anyways, guys, take care. Good luck to you that enter for that truck. Hopefully it doesn't actually need new batteries. Um, and it's just as simple as I'm getting recharged, but we will see what the result is in the next video, possibly tomorrow or the day after. Thank you guys so much for all the love and all the support watching the videos, and I appreciate you, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.